um krishna you can start krishna okay sir hello everyone a very good morning welcome to fibo master master the markets by prem sir today we are again here for the stock selection that is for the next week for from 5th of february to 9th of february uh, today we are focusing on few scripts those are bf utilities bl kashyap genus power hpl electrics india glycol jindal steel moil oil spec and vindya tele now we would like to share them on trading view uh, this is the first script of the day basically this script is at support already had it had given a triangle pattern breakout so we are planning an early entry setup in this so our entry will be planned above 671 for the immediate target of 698 and 715 will be our first rejection zone if this zone is broken we are having a target of 756 and then 800 and 830 then the next rejection zone after 715 will be 830 levels we are keeping this in our watch list for this week and the next script is bl kashyap this script also gave a trend line breakout now uh, it enter in the last trading session it entered into our accumulation area that is about 77 to 80 levels we are planning to have an accumulation entry and above 83 levels we are chasing breakout entry in this for the target of 84 90 94 and if 94 levels are sustaining we might see a target till 104 next script is genus power uh, there is a structural breakout given there is an inverted head and shoulder structure breakout given it uh, broke the previous rejection zone so we are planning our accumulation as well as breakout entry in this script if we got a script near 280 levels we can accumulate or if we plan our entry as a breakout so we can go for a trade about 305 for the target of 327 and 349 uh, till 370 to till 364 there is no rejection area so if we got an opportunity we can trail this trade for our higher targets next one is hpl electrics uh this script has given a pull and flag breakout last week now in this we are only chasing breakout entry about 334 and if we got an opportunity to accumulate near 290 levels we can have an accumulation entry for the target of 368 400 420 and 430 will be our possible rejection zone in this next script is india glycol uh, here entry can be planned only about 975 here only we are chasing breakout not accumulating the script and if we are having a breakout entry then we are keeping a target as 1000 1040 1080 will be our first rejection zone and if that zone is broken then uh, 1000 uh, 1120 will be our uh, probable target another breakout chasing candidate we have is jindal stainless jsl here our entry will be above 625 levels for the target immediate target of 636 656 and 677 here 680 to 700 a psychological level might act as a rejection zone so we will we'll be cautious over this area moy uh in moil there may be two cases or two probabilities will be possible uh, either it came for a retest if it came for a retest near 330 to 335 levels we can accumulate or if it gave a breakout above 375 we can plan our trade so we are focusing on moil according to two probabilities and if we have got uh, as a breakout entry our target will be 400 as an immediate target and once 400 is broken the target are till 438 oil 
Uh, this crypto we have traded with our members from the bottom. Our actual entry was at 300 levels. And uh, this entire move we have caught. Now, this script is again trying to give a fresh breakout. And our breakout entry will be above 450 levels for the target of 464, 485. Again, a probable rejection zone. If this zone is broken, we are keeping a target still 573. Intermediate target will be 507, 530 and 545. Uh, this already trade was uh, done with our members. Now, uh, from this 85 levels, we have accumulated and uh, it met our first target of 100. Now, we are planning to have a breakout entry in this. Once this breakout uh, zone is broken, yesterday tried to broke the zone but didn't sustain. Once this 100 levels are sustaining, we are in a trade for the immediate target of 107. Uh, this is another uh, entering opportunity. If 109 level is broken, there will be a target till 116, 121, and 127. Uh, as a positional target, we are keeping a target till 150 in this script. Because after this uh, breakout entry, uh, till 151, there is no probable rejection zone. So we are tracking this script very closely. And this is our last script of the day, that is Vindhya Telefilms. Uh, it had formed a double bottom structure, a trend line, uh, triangle breakout already given. It approached to our rejection zone, but just we need a confirmation to give us an entry. Our entry will be planned about 2760 levels for the target of 2860, 2900, and till 3000, our targets are open in this. These are the scripts that we filtered for this week. Now, a quick update on the last week filtered scripts. Uh, this was our blockbuster script of the month because this script alone gives us 51%, near about 51% in eight trading sessions. So, this was our blockbuster script. Then, Bombay Dine, our entry was at uh, this level. 165 to 168 was our accumulation entry, but it didn't give an accumulation entry. So our entry will be at 170 levels. Our targets are uh, uh, till 206 and above that, it made high of 191. Still our trade is active. And in this case, it has given us a 6% return. Care rating, our entry was at uh, 148 levels for the target of 100, uh, 1099, 1142. 11.94, it made high of 11.83. Uh, 11 uh, this script has given near about 10% return. EID parry, our entry was at 6.23, exactly hitting our targets. Our target was 6.58, it made high of 6.63. Garvari technical fibers, we were chasing breakout only. Our entry not triggered, so this trade was inactive. Goa Carbon, no candle even sustained this level, so our entry was not active. Indian Bank, our entry level was at 480 levels. First target was 497 to 500, and after that, it was 540 levels. It made high of 553. Our two targets hit. It gives us a decent return. KCP, Sugar, uh, KCP Limited, our entry was above 198 but it made high of 198.60. It didn't sustain 198 level, so our entry was pending in this, so trade was not active. NHPC, our entry was at uh, 83 levels onwards. It opened a little bit gap up, but uh, it gave us an opportunity to enter and hitting our target. Our target was 103. 103 was our probable rejection zone. It rejected that level. It exactly hit the, made the high of 103. Precision wires, our entry level was 145 levels and our first target was 155. It made high of 155.50. Our first target done. Shinier Electrics, uh, although it gives us a target, our tar entry was at seven, 475 and our first target was 500. It made high of 495. And then it uh, again came for a retest. 
but uh, in this case it has given us uh, near about uh, 3 to 6 uh, 3 to 5% return neither our target hit not nor our stop loss has been hit now it's a time to show our weekly roi uh, this week we are able to capture 10% return in which bombay dying has given us 3 6% care rating provide 13% return EID Paddy 5%, Indian Bank provide 15%, NHPC 21%, Precision Wire 7%, and China Electrics gives us 4% return. It's a time for a weekly learning. Uh, trader, trading gets better when you realize that you are not able to catch each and every single move. We just need, have to catch the best possible move which is suitable according to our setup. One best move is much more enough than trading smaller, smaller uh, multiple moves. We can improve our trading by 10x or mul uh, 10 times by using a simple rules. First, make your chart simple rather than using multiple indicators and multiple things in your chart that make your chart clumsy and you are unable to decide what and how to trade. Make your chart simple. Focus only on one setup. Make one setup as your best setup. Try to lower your risk to the minimum. Review each and every trade after its execution. Stop listening to others' opinion once you have to build your conviction. Do your trade on your conviction. Set small goals, execute those goals, and increase them gradually. This is the hard fact why 90% of the traders fail. 90% of the traders fail because of their mindset. They find their age, but they don't execute. They are not disciplined. They make plans, but they break their own rules. That uh, Then, because of their mindset, they set their goals, but after one or two failure, they gave up. So, for a trader, the mindset is the important asset for, your, for their trading career. This is a realistic fact. You became a very dangerous when you know how to trade confidently. If you know how to trade confidently and fearlessly, nobody can stop you. You became unstoppable. Now, this is the rules that Fibo Master follows or Fibo Master wants the new trader to follow so they can become a pro trader. Wait for the exact entry opportunity. Don't jump into the trade as soon as the market opens. You have to wait for the exact entry opportunity. Define your stop loss before entering. Accept what market gives. After analyzing if market is rewarding you, be happy. But if it's uh, uh, if it's hitting your stop loss, don't get upset. Accept it. Focus on the process, not on your uh, profit and loss account. Trading is a process, not just a, a day or two days uh, thing. It's it's a life going process. So focus on the process. Once you start focusing on the process, your PNL will take care of your uh, take care of itself. Take a small break whenever you find uh, you are not convicted or you are stressed up. Take a small break and again come back with a uh, higher energy. This is the positional pick for this week that we are going to share. This is the TCS. In the last trading session, TCS tried to give a breakout. So uh, if any accumulate, uh, anybody wants to accumulate, they can accumulate over this uh, 37 to 3900. A breakout is likely to be possible. This company is related to IT services, having a decent market cap of 14.5 thousand crores, having ROE of 46%, ROC of 59%. We are keeping our targets in TCS still 5000 and 5000 plus. Uh, thank you for your time. If anybody wants to contact us, they can contact us through this mentioned details. Or if any queries, so please let us know. So we would like to help you. Thank you. Thank you so much, Krishna. So uh, the floor is open for uh, discussion. So uh, anybody wants to ask anything, you can ask. Is the right time? Otherwise, we'll wind up. Uh, target in Suslon, we already gave, right? Uh, Suslon, uh, we already have a bigger target. Okay. Um, so the first target was somewhere around 52, I think, uh, if I'm not sure, I gave it at 43 or 40, 44, I think so. Right. 
the first target of mine is around 52, which should be eating by uh, Monday. And then uh, it should be somewhere around 60 or somewhere. I don't know the exact level because I don't have the system with me right now. So, <laughs> so it's a it's a bigger target, man. First target, uh, you, you should be booking your 50% of your target. Like, but if you have um, uh, more than 10,000 shares or 20,000 shares in your thing, close at least for your 5,000 shares around 5,000 or 40% or of your shares, you can close it around uh, uh, somewhere around 52 or 53. When it comes down to 47 or 48, you can again buy that amount of shares. So you will you'll keep on adding it at the lower side and then keep booking the, the lowest one which you bought it. That you can do it. So Vibub Global is also a good one. Uh, Krishna, can you open Vibub Global, which we uh, gave? Vibub uh, Global, uh, it's currently on a uh, down phase, but it's still on the consolidation area where uh, the breakout level happened, right? It breakout or happened around 472 to 474. Uh, so those areas will be your um, uh, area of contract. Now uh, you can, um, some 450 to 470, if you get it, try to buy again for again a target of 550. So uh, that can be done. So any other question that you have other than Vibe of Global IRCTC? IRCTC we already had, no? IRCTC, it's already, yes. uh, already we had, a we already had all the targets met. So again, next target will happen only above, um, there's somewhere around 1000 above, you can uh, see 1120. So go above 1110 uh, uh, somewhere, I, I, correct, right? 1110, yes, it should be a good uh, buy. Uh, maybe 1115 should be a good buy. So on there, you can uh, have a target for another 100 points or 200 points from there. Okay. So HDFC Bank, can you go open HDFC Bank also, Krishna, please? Uh, HDFC Bank is currently going to the lower uh, circuit and then it's going, going to the lower where we already had a target of 1381, which already hit um, uh, in a... In a on that particular day, uh, you will get another another round of entry around 1,038, 1,390 levels. You get one more opportunity of buying. So try to buy around that area. So that should help you in getting your targets on HDFC, HDFC Bank. So um, so there are targets on the lower side, but I, 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 I don't find uh, it will be falling as drastically like this. But if there's something the market is completely um, on the wrong side, then we may see a big fall. But I already this stock has given a big fall, like 300 points is very big for an HDFC bank. So there should be a good support around 1390 and 1400 should be a very good area for buying. Okay. So that's another one. Uh, is there anything uh, which I gave? Dream folks, can you, uh, can you check Dream folks also? Uh, sir, it's uh, near about accumulation area, about yeah. 570. Yeah, it's still an accumulation area. So there's no uh, breakout that happened right up now. So that's all for us. Uh, so if you have any doubts or any queries, please post it to us or uh, to the specified uh, number you can call and you can ask. Uh, that's my number only. You can post uh, your messages to it. Uh, we will help you in uh, anything. Okay. So as of now today, that's all from our side. Um, take care and uh, have a great day, guys. We'll see you on Market Hours. Sir, okay. I, I, I had one question. Uh, yes. On, on a specific stock, uh, we pro, if you please can open. Which one? Yeah, we pro. So, yeah, I mean, for we pro, is there any uh, scope of potential upside move? There is so much potential in Wipro. Yes. It's an accumulation area. It needs to sustain above 490 or, four, uh, or to be precise, 500 levels. Once these levels are broken, we are having a target of 580. Uh, 580? Yeah. Yeah, five, no, the 518 will be the first target and then it goes to 540 and then there is even more bigger targets as there. Okay. Okay, so, uh, I mean, uh, when it cross, when you say when it cross, since it, it, it is a daily chart, so uh, you want it to be closed before 490 or just like crossing by uh, 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 the the thing is uh, it's if you if you go if you go on through the subject right so there is an there's an area where you find uh, the mirror okay yeah it is taking the support from the mirror and you have also have a target with the mirror 
okay the same candle which you are talking about you just look out for the targets you mm-hmm. should get the targets so the first target will be somewhere on 518 somewhere and then after 518 it should be going around 579 and so so forth just go through that you will okay. get it okay okay any other things that you have today sir someone is asking a number my number can you share this uh, ppt okay sir just a minute uh so these are my numbers uh, chinmay okay so take care and uh, bye see you later bye bye take care